Good morning, children. Myself, Nahid Parvi, your EBS teacher from Monbrasia School, Dhanbad. So, children, today we will start our new chapter. That is chapter number 8. Okay? So, all of you take out your EBS book. Now, children, see chapter 8, Festivals Galore. Festival is a way to bring you closer to your family. Means, festival is the way that brings us closer to our family. Because we all celebrate festival together along with the members of our family. Now see festivals in India. So children, in today's session, I will be telling you or explaining you about various religious festival celebrated by about various religious festival or national festivals celebrated by all of us in India. Okay, let us start festivals in India. India is a land of many religions and languages. Religions means dharm. Okay, it is called the land of festivals. India is called the land of festivals means Tiyoharo ki bhoomi also. It is also known as the land of festivals. Many festivals are celebrated in our country throughout the year. Okay, we all celebrate many festivals in our country throughout the year. This includes, see, this include national festivals like Independence Day, Republic Day. Okay. National festivals like Independence Day, Republic Day, this, uh, this is the festival that everyone is celebrating throughout the India. Okay, National festival is celebrating by everyone throughout the India. And religious festivals means Dharmic Utsav like Diwali, Holi, Eid etc. Now let us see religious festivals. See Diwali. So children, in India we enjoy many festivals. Okay, festival of India show our tradition and culture. They make us feel united. United means Ekta, Sanyukt. During festival, we decorate our homes and organize various cultural activities. Okay. Now see Diwali. Diwali or Dipavali. We can say Dipavali also. Diwali or Dipavali is a major festival of Hindus. It is a major festival of Hindus. On this day, Lord Ram returned to Ayodhya after living for 14 years in forests. Means Diwali is the festival of light. It was, it was on this day that, okay, it is the festival, Diwali is the festival of light. It was on this day that Lord Ram returned to Ayodhya after living in 14 years, after living for 40 years in forests. People light up, uh, people light lamps, candles and diyas and diyas everywhere on the occasion of diwali okay it is therefore also known as the festival of lights okay we all lit up our homes we all lit up or light up uh, our homes with lamps candles and diyas everywhere on the occasion of diwali okay people the entire city people lit up the entire city on the occasion of diwali it is uh, therefore um, it is because it is also therefore known as the festival of lights that is why Diwali is the known is is also known as the festival of lights. People wish each other and also exchange sweets and gifts. People wish each other and also exchange means uh, give sweets and gifts to each other. Lord Ganesha and Goddess Lakshmi are worshipped on Diwali. We worship Lord Ganesha and Goddess Lakshmi on Diwali. It is believed that one must clean their houses properly on Diwali. We all clean our houses properly on the occasion of Diwali so that Goddess Lakshmi enters our homes to bless us so that Goddess Lakshmi enters our homes to give us uh, to give us blessing or to bless us okay okay we all decorate our houses with diyas and light and pray to Lakshmi the goddess of wealth wealth means dhan and Lord Ganesh okay Festival Diwali is also known uh, Diwali is the festival of joy and prosperity. Joy means harsh ulas and prosperity means safalta samriddhi. Okay, now children, your homework is read chapter 8 up to dot. Thank you.